Every so often, we get a chuckle, even on serious issues on these Sunday morning programs. Today, CNN, Dana Bash on uh, State of the Union. They're doing the interview as far as uh, they have the panel where they're discussing Nikki Haley. It's inability to tell America what the Civil War was really about. We all know it was about slavery, of course, but she didn't. Uh, she made a fool of herself in several venues. Well, they're discussing it, and a pundit, a Black Democratic pundit, Karen Finney, is going to decide to tell her piece. And it's always good to use a personal story to show how inept a politician is or to show how wrong they are. I want you to listen to this piece from Karen Finney because she had everybody in shock. And I don't think I've ever heard Dana Bash this shot. Listen to this and then we'll take it on the other side. I should have said slavery. <laughs> uh, yeah, well, here's the problem. It wasn't a good answer the first time around. I think it shows a vulnerability when we talk about her as being overly um, prepped for her. Like now she's getting it right because she's got the piece of paper that says what to say. That was the first indication to me, at least that in a general election, she would have a lot of trouble because you get a lot of questions that you can't always predict. But the other thing that struck me is Clearly, this is the tension in the Republican primary around this issue and how to talk about slavery is very different than on the Democratic side. Right. And the fact that she got attacked, but then they defended Donald Trump. They kind of defended uh, DeSantis. He didn't really get a lot of heat from within on that. And it just shows, you know, as someone who is a, a descendant of Robert E. Lee and grew up hearing about the war of northern aggression and the, you know, the lie of the Confederacy, her answer, the other problem with it is it, it sounded exactly like what I heard from my grandmother who was trying to but convince me. Who is a descendant of Robert E. Lee? Me. What? He is my great, 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 great grandfather. On my mom's Did you side. know that? Wow. What? Yeah. That's Don't incredible. That. How are you? <laughs> <laughs> well, one of the things that's so frustrating to me as someone who is, has been a fan of Nikki Haley for quite some time is that she actually has a great answer to that question. I mean, in the last Republican debate, she picked Lincoln. Dana Bash said, uh, what? <laughs> Short says, who is, uh, who's, who's a descendant of Confederate Robert E. Lee? I am, Karen Finney says, a black Democrat. And Karen, Dana Bash was, what? Complete shock. And uh, it was kind of cute because in that one phrase, there was this encapsulation of what slavery, abuse, rape, and all that kind of stuff was in just Karen Finney making that statement that shocked the entire panel. But you know what? It's a learning experience that all Americans would have heard in that one 20 second segment or so. What gives? We spend a lot of time deconstructing the news, trying to, trying to parse it into a form that everybody can understand. We try to find those little nitpicks where uh, it goes, it flies above the fray, etc. If you really like these videos that we do, I want to ask a big favor. Please go ahead, number one, subscribe to our channel, and number two, please join if you can. Thank you so kindly for watching. Keep watching. Please remember to share. We must populate the entire internet with our progressive message, a message that we know is what most Americans say that they want. So help us please join.